The FDA has authorized the marketing of these new glasses that could help a lot of young people that have nearsightedness. Nearsightedness means images up close appear clear, but those far away are blurry. Now, the vision problem is increasing in the U.S. That's according to the National Eye Institute. Fox 13's Ariel Placencia explains how these new glasses work to clear up the picture for young children. Vision is a huge problem for kids. One in four kids actually has some form of vision impairment. It's why the Glazer Vision Foundation has made it their mission to provide free eye exams and glasses to Tampa Bay area kids who need it most. And one of the most common eye problems is myopia. Often called nearsightedness, it means people can see close objects clearly, but objects farther away appear blurry. Myopia causes the eye to grow longer over time, so vision gets worse and the retina gets stretched. Well, the FDA authorized the marketing of new lenses by the company Essilor for kids 6 to 12 years old. These lenses can refocus light onto the retina, which helps slow down elongation of the eye. That's according to the glasses maker, who already partners with the Lions World Vision Institute in Ybor City to make sure local kids have access to regular glasses. They will actually either provide the lenses or for free or do a discount through their through one of their programs. Myopia can get worse over time. But kids who wore these new lenses reportedly saw a 70% reduction in their myopia progression after two years, according to company data. It's exciting because this is something that, you know, long term will help a child. Traditional glasses and contact lenses don't slow myopia down, but work to improve vision, experts say. There are some eye drops and special contact lenses that can help manage myopia, but new developments in eye technology are always needed. When we think about how they do in the classroom and behaviorally, these advancements in prescriptions and glasses and those opportunities can change the trajectory of their life. In Tampa, Ariel Placencia, Fox 13 News.